This a rolling, not a stop. Watch shit don't never stop. Shit got super hot. Good morning, everybody. It is like, wait, I've just got McDonald's breakfast, so it must be like 20 past 10 or something like that. Yeah, it's like 20 past 10. And at 11 o'clock, I am going to meet Ash from Vibe and Peter, I think his name is. Um, so we're upgrading all my speakers and I'm going to attempt to fit the sub. Might go wrong. But anyway, I'd, I didn't want to start this vlog here, but I'm going to because I am fuming. You all know how much I like food. You all know how much I like McDonald's. I've just gone and got a McDonald's breakfast and opened my sausage muffin thing because I don't get egg in it because that them eggs are literally like they're non-existent. They aren't even eggs. They're just a piece of plastic. Um, I'm traumatized like what happened to my cheese why is half of my cheese stuck to the paper what what i don't even think that's like peelable oh it's actually not oh god sick you can explain because i don't know what he's doing we're gonna do a, a plug yeah, and play explain. speaker upgrade. there you go see there you go plug and play speaker upgrade and it just looks like he's attacking my door it's all right and ignore all the makeup on the door that's not me Go home. that's laura <laughs> i hate that <laughs> look how so clean that is why can't my whole car look that clean <laughs> These are a bit stiff. Right, I'm only doing one. Still, you know. These are a bit stiff. I'll definitely make it to the video. <laughs> <laughs> I can finally tell people we've actually done something on my own car. Well, they all still a sub for in a bit. They all, <laughs> they all moan at me. Have you done a TT before? Yeah. Okay. But nobody's ever had. You can't do plug and play speaker upgrades in these unless you buy a very expensive kit from another brand, and it's very expensive. Oh. We are gonna do the first ever vibe plug and play speaker kit Great. for this car and it'll be good you ready for this yes there's your bow speaker you ready it's so tiny that's so pathetic you pay to like all this money for a car why is it leaking why is it leaking it's not that's just the the glue holding the leads down oh, that's horrendous that's pathetic and it actually says it's bows as well bows out out of my <laughs> Turn it around. Look how much better the size of that is. So much better. Oh no, it's gonna break my wrist. <laughs> how tight do they need to be? You'll feel it bite. This doesn't go in. It's not a glamorous shot that you know, with hair stuck over your face. Right. <laughs> I'm not glamorous anyway. I'm sweating. This is Xavier fitting stuff on her own car. Yeah. I've got to get up now. Under strict supervision. <laughs> yeah, I don't like, go loose on my own car. Time. Okay, apparently it's nice finished and you're going to put the door card back on and then we're going to do the we're sub in the back. Yeah, yeah, we're going to look at doing the sub and we're going to do the driver's door as well. Look, you can see it's you. Promo. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, Ash has just pointed out that the amp for this setup is actually smaller than my own phone and this is an XS Max, so look at the size and that goes with the sub in the back. Yep. Is it hidden or unsure? The amp will be on the back of the sub of the box, but you can see as well, that's a, just a normal iPhone 8. It's literally the same size as an yep. iPhone 8. So it's super compact, so it can be hidden anywhere in the car. In this case, it's going to be in the boot. That's sick. Get it in a smart car, you yeah. can fit someone in there. Yeah, fit in anything. <laughs> People have used them on motorbikes as well. Really? So can be out of the way and that's going to power the subwoofer that you're going to be installing. Yay, can't wait. It's all going to go wrong. <laughs> okay, Ash, are we putting this? Okay, so with this installation, you literally just need to plug that into the factory fuse box. So, if you go in here, oh. you can see the red 15 amp fuse. What, this? Yep. What? Next to it. So, the one after that. There we go. No. Is in? Yeah. So then all you would do, or you will do in a minute, is you'll run the cables all down, down here. through the trims, yep. and up into the boot, yep. and that's power. See? How easy was that? Easy. easy. Even I can do it. I'm sat in the boot for this because it's so much easier when I hit. Um, but we need to clip this thing, whatever this, what's this called? It's a quick connector, it's not focusing. Hello, focus! Tap the screen. <laughs> oh, look at you, little YouTuber! <laughs> is it focused now? Yeah. Yay! Okay, wait, right, what is it? It's just a quick connector, so it gets a signal into the amplifier, so it allows it to play music. Sick. Right, okay, so we're going to clip it onto whatever this red and brown wire is. 
Okay, so yeah, simply click that on and we're on. The tweeters are now fit, but Ashley's gonna show you because I'm currently stuck in the boot, so Ashley's gonna, gonna show you. We fit the amp and we're gonna wire the speaker wires to the amp to fit the sub. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Oh, he's turned it down now so we don't get copyrighted. Is it going in? Yeah. I can see your face in it. I definitely did. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> yeah. You can see it. Huh? Now what we're doing, now we're fitting the sub. Yeah, so now the sub. So we're going to tidy all these wires up first. Now we finished, it's taken about two hours, we've got the sub in. Hello, it's so tiny, I'm definitely going to still fit two suitcases in there. Well, I'm hoping anyway. And my little toy car, hopefully that goes in. But it sounds sick, it sounds so much clearer than the original ones I had, which was shit. So yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Although I didn't want to be on camera. <laughs> Yeah. Oh wow, right. I'm going to do so much with them. Disappeared in shame. So yeah, that's it all fitted. I can't actually believe how tiny it is. I told you it wasn't going to take up. Yeah, but when you said tiny, I thought, huh, tiny, but what's tiny? I just told you it wasn't going to take up too much room. Yeah. Hopefully everything will fit in there. Have you got earbuds? Can you clean your ears while you're driving? Or clean your pens. Yeah, whatever. Because he's into all sorts of kinky stuff. Ash! <laughs> so as you can tell, I'm back home. Hello car! So I'm gonna just like run you through while I'm on my own of the stuff. Of of the tings. Of the music tings. Oh wow, I'm so chubby. <laughs> So the boot is a little bit messy because obviously I've got my cleaning products in there ready for this weekend and Yeah, I actually can't believe how small the box actually is like when Ash was going on. Oh, yeah, it's small like I thought small but not small small and especially from the base that comes from that Jesus like if you hear it culture shock or whenever you see me you'll be like no way is that from that sub like it's tiny, so tiny. If you just look like this, you won't, you wouldn't even be able to really notice it. It just looks like another cleaning bag. It's that small, but yeah, it's like my hands like that big. So it's it, it's really small, and I'm I'm loving that. It's like the carbon effect. Yes, vibe. So it's a black hair, little mini sub, so cute. And like like I said, what on what on earth are them? I just want to point out, people actually pay for the upgrade of Buzz in the Audis, and that is what you're getting, guys. That is what you're paying. God knows how much money for. Good job I didn't pay it because I'd have been fuming. Obviously, you can tell that we upgraded the door speakers, the tweeters. But yeah, um, so tiny. I wish I could show you it. Like, I wish I could let you hear it in person because on here it'd sound horrendous. And not only that, but I would probably get copyrighted. I wonder if I could show you the bass though. Maybe. From like, if we shut all the doors, let you hear the bass from outside. Should we try it? <laughs> the exhaust is even rattling. Oh my God. Surely that's not safe. Oh my God. Even from like a distance. I hope you can pick this up on the camera. But it's just so loud. Yes, it's not going to keep up with the competition people um, who have like all the speakers in the back of the car and like the big build in the back. But that's fine for me because I need a boot. Like obviously with the Scirocco, I never had a boot. So it's now it's nice to have one. <laughs> so I want to keep it that way. Hence why we've not got an air tank in it and stuff. So hopefully, like I said, it will fit two suitcases in and my little mini car for this weekend. So we'll, we'll test out actually how much room it takes up. <laughs> Thank you to Vibe Audio and Ash who's down there and also thank you to Skipton they're really nice guys thank you Peter for doing for doing this for me I appreciate it like I just said five star rating for their customer service down there because it like when we got it done it was good um but it just weren't basic enough for like my personal preference so I just said to him you know what can I have it a bit more basic and he dropped everything and he was like, yeah, of course I will. Of course I'll sort it out for you. Thank you for watching and go down below and check the links out to the companies because they are gang gang. And not only that, but to point out that it is so easy to fit. Oh my God, anybody can fit it. Like, I mean, 
anybody if i can you can anybody can so go check them out thank you for watching goodbye